how to make the most in your clinicals in nursing school. What is good YouTube? This is NWA here, Nurse Pat, coming at you with another video. This video is for my nursing students out there seeking some guidance. I hope this helps you guys. So clinicals could be terribly scary for everybody when it's your first time. Working with real people instead of the mannequins, the models, and the dummies in your skills lab is very different. But do not worry, you will get more comfortable as the days go on. You just have to get out of that zone. Yes, you can! Just do it! So here's some tips and advice based on my experience and my colleagues' experience on how to make the best out of your nursing clinicals. Number one thing, in my opinion, be eager to learn and practice as many skills as you can while you're in your clinicals. I personally regret not doing as much as a nursing student. I was a little shy, a little scared and stuff, and I didn't take as much opportunity for certain things as much as I should have. Having more practice and skills will prepare you better for when you're working with your license as an actual nurse. Number two, when you're doing your medication administration, always be prepared and know your six rights. Or is it seven or eight rights? I don't know, they keep adding them on, I don't know. And if it's with your instructor, be prepared to be asked, what's the patient taking the medication for and what are the side effects, what to look out for, all that stuff. Number three, try to have a calm and compassionate demeanor with your patients because your anxiety is contagious. If you're feeling overwhelmed, take a step back, take some deep breaths and just reassure yourself that you got this. Do it! Just do it! But at the same time, number four, be humble. Do not act like a, a know-it-all that's overconfident, over, you know, overly cocky. Nurses will be annoyed as hell with you. Like, who the hell does this little baby student nurse think he or she is? I could teach you how to do it. I know how to do it. You know nothing, Jen Snow. We're all learning stuff day by day. We don't know everything, even the nurses that have been working there for years. We are always learning something new. Number five, if you see that there's anything iffy or off about the patient that you're working with, let your nurse know right away. I've fallen and I can't get up. Nurse! Safety is always the number one priority with the patient. You will fail and get kicked out of your clinicals if you're deemed unsafe in the clinical setting. And then you'll just get blacklisted, you can't be there anymore, and there goes your chance of getting a job there afterwards. You do not want to be a student that other nurses will be worried about you for with their patient. Oh God, that, man, that's, that nursing student's hella spooky. I don't trust them with my patient. This sets back your whole semester or quarter in a nursing program. It does not matter if you're passing your other classes, you're acing your tests and whatnot. If you do not pass that semester or quarter for your clinicals, you're held back no matter what. Now you need to be careful. You could also fail your clinicals for a lack of progression. For instance, what the instructors want to see is that as you're moving on your semesters, you're making some type of progression in terms of assertiveness, learning, and practicing skills. If you're too scared and don't want to do anything, what the nurses and instructors will see is that, you know, they're, they're giving you these opportunities for you to grow and learn, yet you're too scared. So maybe you're not ready to move on. That's their mindset. But please don't take it the wrong way. Your instructors and the nurses there are there to see you succeed. And they just want to give you that little push out of your comfort zone in order for you to grow. You may feel like it's intimidation and pressure, but it kind of is necessary in my opinion for someone to succeed. You can't just keep spoon feeding the nursing students all the stuff. <laughs> Slight anxiety will help you grow and learn. And every time you do something, what was making you anxious before doesn't anymore. You're comfortable with it, you're learning, and you're just overall growing. And that's how it is when you're a nursing student, how it is when you're a new grad, and how it is when you're even like a nurse for multiple years and you're trying out a different unit. So it's just all part of the process. I really hope all of you take advantage of your clinicals and the experiences that you will have. 
I know all of you will succeed and do great. I hope you guys found this content helpful. Let me know what's up if you agree, disagree, or have some experiences yourself. If you haven't already, check out the video here for nursing school expectations and myths based on what I've experienced. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you're feeling the content. Stay safe, stay humble, I'm out.